For a small society like Palau, fragile environment, very limited uh, resources, very limited opportunities, we have to basically live with the environment. And this is where our traditions comes into focus. Bull literally translated is prohibition. But there's a deeper meaning to bull. Prohibition in the sense that you're doing this to benefit your children. You're doing this because you have to think about tomorrow, and the day after tomorrow, and the year is coming. When uh, we see that a uh, certain spot is depleting, so much we, we apply that bull. And then it uh, revives itself. I'm a fisherman and I like to think of myself as uh, having taken a leave of absence from fishing so that I could serve in public service. What I have been doing is uh, making those traditions and practices uh, into the laws of the land so that it's just not common knowledge or, or traditional practices so that it's being enforced uh, by the people and also enforced by the laws of the land. Spearfishing is uh, requires you to have some big uh, lung to go down and really wait for the fish. And you also have to be a good swimmer. And you have to really go down and hold your breath and get underneath the rock and lure the fish into a shooting range. It's a good game. When I spearfish, I usually challenge myself to shoot a certain kind of fish. Once I trick it and shoot it, I'm done for the day. You only take uh, what fits in your pot. If you only take what you need and leave the rest for the next day, it's protecting them. But I just take what I can eat at that time. If I put them in the freezer, I make sure I'll share with the neighbors. My relatives come, it's a present. Different factors have caused declines in, um, in reef fish populations. Uh, in many places, it was the mechanization or, or modernization of fishing gears um, that's led to humans basically becoming far too efficient at catching fish. I guess the world is, is driven by economic considerations and um, giving nature time to recover is not necessarily what gives you the greatest economic return in the short term. And so that kind of thinking has, I guess, brought us work to where we are today. Palau, we actually have a same legacy. We, we want to live the world a little bit better than what we came into. That's the Palawan traditional teaching. Uh, that's the legacy that we all